Amongst all the great dad that we go through each week, I've got two really important things. One is a special announcement, and the other one is, of course, some incredible things are happening in the data, so don't go away. Hey, it's great to see you once again at Whizbang's blog. It's fantastic to have you here, and I really do appreciate your time and effort. I've got a really important thing to share with you right now. So it's, it's, a, it's amazing. It's called masterclasslessons.com. It's a website that we've put up and put a heck of a lot of work into and releasing training courses on. The first one is a training course on what does it mean to monetize your domain traffic. There's over two and a half hours of footage up there at the moment, so I thought I'd give you a sneak preview and just show you what you can do on it. So just bear with me for a second. Okay then, so here we are, masterclasslessons.com. So um, right here, uh, when you first come to the site, uh, you can see it's a free registration, everything's free. Um, so we're making sure that it's completely available, to, particularly to the, the readers of Whizbang's blog and, and ParkLogic customers and anyone in the domain industry for that matter. And right here, so if I just go along and uh, press the class trailer, this is, this is a class on domain monetization. It's a domain monetization. So we, I'll give you a sneak little view just there. And here it comes. I already know everything about domains. Here's an important life lesson. No one that's successful assumes they know everything. Taking some numbers, holding them in my hand, and then punching myself in the face with them is what I do on a daily basis. We're going to unlock domain monetization like we've never done before. What frustrates me is that so many people leave so much money on the table when it's so easy to unlock that revenue. We're going okay then, so, so what, what do, can we do to, uh, on this site? If I just go ahead and sign in, uh, to register, it's, it's really simple to register. There, there's nothing, nothing to it at all, just you, know, you need your email address and senior password basically. But there's a whole series of um, fantastic um, uh, instructional videos on monetization. What does it mean to monetize? A bit of a history about myself, of course, the four domain business models, looking at what they are. Um, there is, uh, is domain monetization dead? That's what gets asked me all the time. To understand the fundamentals, RPM, uh, measuring success, how do we measure success, benefits of traffic routing, rotating versus algorithmic switching. Um, there's impact of direct advertising, managing a large portfolio. There's a whole stack of things just there uh, ready for you to take a look at. So I hope you really like love that. It's um, masterclasslessons.com. Whatever you do, go there, sign up, take a look at the courses, love your feedback on them also. Um, and it's something to put a lot of effort into. We plan on releasing some more, more videos. One of the ones I'd love to be able to release is one on how to run a traffic test and what does it mean to run a traffic test. So there can be more video videos we pushed up there. But it's really trying to, I guess, give back to the domain community. I really want to give back to the domain community. The domain industry has been so good to me and I wanted to, to sort of synthesize all the knowledge I've gained over the years and uh, we did have it park logic here and then give it back to the industry to help you guys out to become better domain investors. But I hope you like it. But um, without further ado, we're going to get stuck into this week's numbers. So let's go ahead and take a look at um, this week's numbers. I'll get them up on the screen here. And here we go. I must admit, I, I always love taking a look at these numbers. This is week 19. I can't believe that it's flown so fast um, or, already. So if we take a look at week 19, I've added this new chart in here. And this came from one of the, re the readers of Whizbang's blog who found the videos and everything like that and really gave me some great feedback. And they said, hey, can we take a look at the revenue, um, uh, the revenue over time? So I thought, how do we do that? Because obviously I can't reveal our revenue numbers. That's not possible. 
Um, oh, gee, I just noticed I got a little typo there. But the revenue number is is comparing today's revenue number versus the average of the previous month. This is what this chart is. So it's versus the previous 28 days. So I'm comparing each day versus the average of the previous 28. And you can see right there what's actually happening. Um, so we're in an upward trend right now, which is great news. In other words, we're all in the monetization space earning more dollars. And I love that. So that gives you an idea. So if you look at your own portfolio and you're thinking, uh-oh, it's not really looking like that. Have a chat to us. Love to be able to talk to you. Take a look at uh, masterclasslessons.com and learn some more about how, what does it mean to monetize domain traffic. I'm going to keep on pushing that and I'm really excited about masterclasslessons.com. But anyway, so um, that's the first thing. Now if we take a look at the, the, the aggregate normalized RPM and RPM charts. So take a look at that red line, the RPM. The RPM just taking off, so is normalized RPM. And uh, when, we, when we take a look at this, uh, at the top right hand, then in there, wow. That's all I can say, that is a big wow. Um, it's, done, it's doing the same here um, I, and uh, as well, but oh, that normalized RPM and RPM chart, that is something which you can only just dream about normally. It's not often you see that um, other than a shock to the system. And you can see that's happened with COVID just down in the, in the blue line there for the normalized RPM. But let's take a look at the earnings per click. And once again, take a look at the surge in click through rate. Once again, it's, it is, it's, a, it's a case of wow. And the right hand then there is just skyrocketing upwards that, that, that click through rate, which is, which is tremendously exciting. Normally, I just ignore the EPC and CTR charts, but every now and then they surprise me and they get me really excited about what's going on. And uh, even though the EPC earnings per click is a bit flat, the, the, the click-through rate is just taken off like you wouldn't believe. And we can see this here. Um, this is the just a trend line. Uh, I think this is the, an average 14-day uh, trend line. Um, and you can see it's just taken off. Look. There it is, that red chart there. And that, that's the, um, sorry, that's that was the EPC, my, my mistake, uh, my mistake. So if we look back at this, the red line is taken off. Oh my goodness. Yeah, the red line's taken off. It, 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 uh, I, I read this chart incorrectly. I do apologize for that. But here, I'm just going to flick back to the main screen. The EPC's taken off. That is, that is a huge issue. That is a huge issue for domain monetization. Remember, I kept on saying that, that it was the uh, we had all the small to medium sized businesses that come online and soaked up the demand. Um, as COVID happened, they came online and uh, the the large corporate advertisers exited the market really, and the small advertisers kind of like soaked up the, all the traffic because they couldn't sell stuff in their bricks and mortar shops anymore. Like I, I bought a, a, a drone the other day, as you do, of course. I bought a drone and the guy said he's closed his brick and mortar shop down, he's operating out of home and he's stock sitting in his garage. And I'm going, fantastic. I said, how's business going? He said, bigger than ever. And I'm going, even better. Isn't that great? So uh, I would say this here, this EPC line, is the beginning of the corporates coming back. We're in for a time of our lives. If I'm right on that, remember I said there'd be a 5% upswing? I said a 5% upswing during the North American summer. Normally it's 10 to 15% down. It's happening and it's really accelerating. In fact, overall in Park Logic, we've had our biggest days ever. They're just booming. And normally it's depressed this time of year. It is really going. So let's take a look back here again. Um, so the CTR, like, that's great. I can't believe that graph's actually telling us some interesting stuff. So if we look at volatility, um, we, we're getting the edge of that, that upswing once, once more, and it's generally positive uh, compared to the previous week. So what's going on here? And you can see what's going on with blue, which is Google, red, which is direct. Google is just, it, it, it's obviously advertisers flooding into Google and spin you up big, which makes you wonder whether it's time to actually start to buy some Google shares. 
because this is a leading indicator, like if there ever was one. The direct advertisers are, are falling back in terms of the percentage of revenue coming um, from their, their direction. They're actually falling away, which is, in one sense, it's a shame. There's another sense of who cares as long as you get paid a whole lot of money. So, <laughs> so that's okay. Um, but the direct advertisers, strangely, are winning a bit of traffic here, and Google is losing a bit of traffic. So maybe Google's trying to get more traffic. Well, let's take a look at the... Um, the normalized RPM chart. <laughs> wow. Um, <laughs> look at that. That's, that's a chart you don't see that often. Check that blue line out, which is the normalized RPM for Google. Look at that skyrocket. Like, that's just... Wow. That, that is phenomenal. We saw that back here. Um, just a brief blip. I hope it's not a blip like that. Um, uh, back at the high sort of the COVID time. And maybe this is just like COVID once again, uh, biting or the corporates are going, hey, we're, we're back guys. And we realize this COVID thing is going to be around a lot longer than we thought. So we can't just stop advertising. We're going to have to come back into the market. Oh, oh no, we have to compete more for the traffic because there's all these other businesses there. Oh no, what are we going to do? Guess what they're going to do? They're going to compete. Um, if you're a small business, I'm sorry for that um, difficulty. If you're a domain owner and domain investor, well done. Okay, so, and you can see here, the, the direct advertising has definitely flo uh, fallen away. I was hoping that last week, that these last couple of data points here were indicators of it trending back up, but hey, it's fallen away, which is a real shame. I always like having more people fighting for the traffic. It's always great. And you can see there the blue line is this, this is zoomed in on that last couple of weeks. Um, and you can see there the blue line has, um, has accelerated upwards. Let's take a look here. Uh, the volatility, oh my gosh. The, the uh, direct advertisers have been a lot more, more volatile this time. And, the, uh, and Google is uh, really accelerating forward, which is incredible. So, wow. A great big announcement, masterclasslessons.com. Go there, sign up. Doesn't cost you anything. And take a look at those lessons. I really hope they help you out. Uh, that's the, the, the goal for them. And we'll be adding more and more things to that site as um, uh, and I get some interactivity happening and that sort of stuff as well. Um, love your feedback on the videos, but love your feedback, just in the whole concept as well, but it's trying to give back to the community. And EPCs are accelerating, normalized RPMs going up. Hey, life is good as a domainer. So make sure you have an absolutely spectacular week. And don't forget, hey, we got um, my personal musings coming up in the weekend. And I can guarantee it's going to be an absolute crackerjack this time. Thanks a lot for that. Bye. I hope you enjoyed that video and you find them really valuable for your business and helping you make better decisions. Don't forget to like subscribe or pass the video on to your friends. Anyway, thanks a lot for that. Have a great day. Bye.